Hey guys, Tom here, and today is the 3rd of May 2012, and Jagex have just posted two new news articles on the front page. So the first one is a performance improvement, and that's the reason I've got my frames per second displayed in the corner, is because if you type in the developer's console, I think it's called, uh, by pressing the wiggly button next to the number one on your keyboard, you'll bring this up and type in display FPS, but I've already done that, and then you'll get to see your frames per second, and you should be able to notice a significant improvement. I mean, I'm in the rune span on high detail settings, and I'm on 30 frames per second, so that's not too bad. Uh, so that's the big update for today and they've apparently got rid of bots but I've only just logged in myself and there's obviously no bots in the rune span so uh, if you go around Varrock and have a look for green dragon bots I'm sure you'll be able to notice less of them and the other update for today, well it's not so much an update but sort of a uh, preemptive reminder of the wild weekend that's going to happen this weekend starting from Saturday the 5th and ending uh, Sunday the 6th. Basically all that's going to happen this weekend is on the Squeal of Fortune, which I'll just bring up for you right now, uh, sometimes you'll see the horns and tattoos in this middle slot where this huge XP lamp is, but this weekend they're apparently going to be in these silver and, no, sorry, the red... no the uncommon and common slots, so I think that's the gold and the silver ones, uh, there'll be horns and tattoos in these slots, so you should have a very high chance of getting some of them, so that'll be pretty nice for those of you that want it. And that's pretty much it for the updates today, I'll just do a few Squeal of Fortune spins, uh, might as well keep that. What a surprise, I got jack shit. Okay, and I might as well tell you, well that's pretty much the updates for today, so if you're not interested in what I'm doing right now, feel free to leave the video, but yeah, since the runes ban came out, I've pretty much been here the entire time I've been logged in, and I've got 10 room crafting levels in about 3 days, so I'm quite chuffed with that, and you might be able to notice I almost have... Uh, a total of 15,000 points so I can almost afford the Wicked Robe top and I now have the level requirement to wear it as well which is 80 so I've also bought the Wicked Cape and the Wicked Legs so I've almost got the full set of Wicked so what I'm going to do after this video I'm going to do some more rune span get those last few points that I need which is less than a thousand and then I will do a mini review on the Wicked Robe set and what it does and everything. So look forward to that if you're curious as to what the Wicked Robe set does. Other than that, not, not much else to say. Uh, should be a new video very soon with our friend over at Rune House Videos, who is an extremely cool guy. You should go and subscribe to him because he's Australian. And I'll see you in the next video.